When I was in my second year of high school, there was a girl I was really close with. Her name was Fuka Yoshioka, and we met at school. One day, we were walking home together from school. Tatsuki, will you go out with me? Oh, um, I'm sorry. I have no interest in stuff like love or dating. Oh, um, I was just kidding around. <laughs> you didn't have to think about it so seriously. But what, really? Yeah. I wouldn't hold it against you if you rejected me, so don't worry about it. I guess it wasn't such a big deal to her. But I never thought that three years later we'd meet again at a group date. Wait, who was the one who said they had no interest in love or dating? Ah, she said she wouldn't hold a grudge, but obviously she is. Where did the bitterness of youth go? Well, since we're both 20 now, I guess we should have a talk about it. I had to tell her why I rejected her even though I liked her. The events that led to this group date started five days ago. I'm Tatsuki Mamiya, a second year university student. I'm currently working part time at a family restaurant. Hey you, what time do you get off work? It's 7 p.m. Do you want to hang out after? Ah, uh, sorry, I have plans. Ugh, I'm beat. It's not that often, but sometimes female customers or girls ask me to hang out. But I'm not so good in social situations or holding conversations. It's not the only reason, but I always just tell them that I have plans and turn them down. You turn down an invite from a customer again? Must be nice to be so popular. Ryo Senpai, please don't get involved. Her name is Ryo Kogane. We go to different universities, but she's only a year older than me. She's bright, friendly, and beautiful. For some reason, she always wants to chat with me after work. Are you still hung up on that girl you rejected in high school? Yeah, I guess so. What was her name again? I know, I've never told you before. Please stop trying to get it out of me. Desukai Hanaka-chan? What? I definitely don't know any girls of sumo-related names. What about Yorikiri Kaika-chan? Why is it all sumo-related? As you can tell, Ryo Senpai is a big fan of sumo. Don't you think it's kind of youthful to fall in love inside the ring? I'm not sure youthfulness is the first thing that comes to mind. <laughs> That's a good one. Please don't laugh at yourself. <laughs> so anyways, how many girls have you wrestled in the ring with? I have no idea what that means. Maybe there's a girl you wrestle with every night. Japan's national sport is nothing like that. I had no idea if we were talking romance or sumo anymore. Oh, by the way, are you free this Saturday? I know you are. Come grab a drink with me. Uh, I'm good. Oh, come on. I'll help you get your mind off that girl. I'll pass. See ya. That girl, huh? As I walked home, I was thinking about Fuka Yoshioka. It's not easy to forget someone like that. I haven't seen her since high school, but I wonder how she's doing. The next day, a friend from class came up to talk to me. Tatsuki, are you free this Saturday? You are, right? Do you want to go get some drinks with us? <laughs> oh, stop assuming. Also, you too, huh? Well, what do you mean, you too? It's nothing. If it's for drinks, I'll pass. You always turn me down. It's just drinks. Why don't you come out just once? Um. Anyways, I'll send you the time and place later. So I'll see you there. And this is how I got robbed into going out for drinks. Wait, this is a group date. You know, it was only supposed to be a group of friends, but eventually some girls showed up. Hey, you tricked me. No, oh, you must have heard me wrong. This is just a simple get together with guys and girls. <laughs> that, uh, don't leave out important information like that. But the problem wasn't that it was a group date. Hmm, you won't go out with me, but you'll go on a group date? It's not that, I was tricked. For some reason, real senpai was there, but it was a more serious problem. Why is Fuka here? It looks like she's smiling, but her eyes are not. So scary. For some reason, even Fuka Yoshioka, who I rejected in high school, was there. When I rejected her, I told her I had no interest in love or relationships, so it's extremely awkward. There was no good timing to make an excuse to escape, so before I knew it, the group date started. Okay, now that everyone's here, let's cheers! Cheers! Cheers. Uh, cheers. 
I was planning to stay quiet and let it pass, but Real Senpai started talking to me. Tatsuki Ken, aren't you drinking? Ugh, you're such a killjoy. Oh, yeah, the girl I dumped is here. By the way, uh, why are you here on a group date? My friends asked me to come because they didn't have enough girls. Oh, yeah, I'll introduce you. This is Fuka Yoshioka. She's my junior in the same circle. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm Fuka Yoshiaka. Oh, yeah, I'm Tatsuki Mamiya. Nice to meet you. Is she pretending not to know me on purpose? Fuka-chan says that she wanted to join a group date to fix her broken heart. Yes, I was rejected by a boy from my class in high school. What? No one would reject someone as cute as you. Tell me their initials. Why initials? What would she even do with that information? His last name is Mamiya, so TM. That's basically half my name! The guy from TM Revolution? Why would it be a famous singer? What is Team Mamiya Revolution anyways? <laughs> so, why did Revolution reject you anyways? What was the point of asking for my initials? Now they're referring to me as Revolution. He said that he had no interest in love or dating. What? He totally friend-zoned you. But you know, he could be one of those guys who says that, but then secretly goes on group dates. That's believable. Actually, I'm 100% sure that he does. Oh my gosh, are you psychic or something? Uh, I want to go home. And so, it was as awkward as that the entire time. That reminds me. You're still hung up on a girl you dumped in high school too, right, Tatsuki-kun? Gah! Real senpai, uh, that story is... What? Was I not supposed to say anything? Um, well... Well, I guess it wouldn't be terrible if it came up. Actually, if I could explain myself, maybe Fuka would finally understand. Well, to be honest, I agreed to come today without knowing it was a group date. <laughs> so that's what you meant when you said you were tricked. Usually I turn down invitations for group dates. That's true. You always turn down female customers when they hit on you, too. I guess that girl from high school really is that important to you. Of course. So, if you like her that much, why did you reject her? Oh my gosh, I want to know too! Me too, me too! I want to hear about your love life! That's fine, but it's really not that interesting. <laughs> I guess it was just really bad timing. When I started high school, my father's company went bankrupt and we suddenly became poor. My mom's part-time job wasn't enough to pay the bills, so I had to work too. To be honest, it wasn't a good time to be dating. But I didn't want to give up on going to university. When I was in my third year of high school, my dad finally found a job at a good company. So now we live pretty normal lives. I'm glad that I didn't give up working so that I could continue my education, but on the other hand, I've always been worried about that girl. I couldn't tell by her expressions if Fuka was surprised or understanding about what I was saying. It would have been fine if this concluded everything, but... Oh, it must have been so hard. You're such a good boy, Tatsuki-kin. Oh, um, real, senpai? I'm so moved. You're a hard worker, serious, and determined. You're the best kind of boyfriend. Thank you for that. So why don't you forget about that girl and go out with me? What? Did you hear anything I just said? I still have feelings for that girl. That girl has totally forgotten about you by now and is probably sumo wrestling with someone else. What does that mean? If I was your girlfriend, I would make you delicious Chanko hot pot every day. Miso soup is more than enough. You can't get strong with just miso soup. Don't be so naive about the world of sumo. She seems like the kind of person who wants to raise a man to the top into a sumo wrestler. Ryo, that's not fair. I want to be Tetsuki's girlfriend. Me too, me too. Let's calm down, everyone. Oh no, I just wanted to talk to Fuka, but everyone joined in. Everyone began introducing themselves, saying they wanted to be my girlfriend. That's not fair, Tatsuki! Group dates are for everyone! Now, you're the one who was wrong for tricking me in the first place. That's because you're good with girls. So I was hoping to get your leftovers. <laughs> what an ass. That's a horrible reason. Anyways, Ryo-san. What? Me? 
I'm going to aspire to be a grand champion sumo wrestler. So please make Chanko hot pot for me every day. Um, this is definitely the wrong time for a confession. If you can even call that one. Hmm. At best, I think you could only ever be a third Divison wrestler. So mean! Is that mean? I don't know, but isn't even a third division wrestler impressive? I think. Anyways, it didn't seem like we'd be able to get the group data under control even within an hour. And then, Fuka suddenly stood up and grabbed my arm. Let's get out of here. What? Um, wait! Uh, Fuka-chan? That's the best line to hear at a group date! And so, we left the restaurant as if we were escaping. Uh, thanks for saving me back there. <sighs> huh? Are you mad? Fuka, what's wrong? What do you mean, what's wrong? Why didn't you tell me that your family was going through a hard time in high school? Well, I guess to protect my pride. I suppose there really was no reason to bring it up. Your pride? How was I supposed to tell you that I had no time for you because my family was poor? It's heavy stuff. Did you think I was the type of girl who cared about money? No, it's nothing like that. As a punishment for not telling me, now you have to buy me 10 luxury bags. So you do care about money. Of course I'm joking, but I do wish you had told me the truth. Sorry about that, but it was because I liked you that it was so hard to tell you. Because I liked you, so I wanted you to feel like you could confide in me. I see. <laughs> but didn't you play it off as a joke back then? That's because I didn't want you to think I was a needy person. And now? Now, I want to lock you up for 24 hours and spy on you. That's not needy, that's scary. But you know what? I guess we're both needy people. Even at 20 years old, we've both been hung up on a broken heart for three years. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yes, senpai might say we're sumo grand champions. That makes sense. That reminds me. I've been meaning to ask you, does that mean you like me? Uh, yeah. So, I guess the feeling's mutual. I'm glad. This is kind of embarrassing. What do you like about me? When we were in high school, do you remember that everyone treated me like an introvert? You were the only person who was nice to me. Tatsuki, you thought you were an introvert? Well, I thought I was. I think that's a misunderstanding. You were actually really popular amongst the girls. What, really? I guess I was too busy with everything going on to notice. It's true. All the boys are jealous of you for it, so that's why they called you an introvert behind your back. All the girls were always talking about how cool and handsome you were. Got it. Thanks for telling me. I'm going to head back to the group date now. Seriously? Now you have the confidence? Are you planning to take all the men down now? I'm joking. Hmm, your eyes aren't joking. Anyways, what I wanted to say was that I was one of those girls that liked you. And the other girls? Um, yeah. Right now is not the time to worry about them. I wanted to ask just in case. Hmm. You're planning on taking down all the guys at our reunion, aren't you? If you're gonna be like this, I really do need to keep you locked up under 24-hour surveillance. I mean, it depends where. You're fine with being locked up? With some conditions, if I have three meals a day, a couch, a fridge, and internet, I'll be fine. <laughs> I've never heard of someone put under surveillance under their own terms. Ugh, I feel like I'm becoming yandere. Please don't, let's just start dating. And just like that, the bad feelings we had pent up over the past three years disappeared, and we started dating. There's no question that we feel the same way about each other, so as long as I don't mess up again, I'll be careful. Yeah, it's school the next Monday. I noticed you guys went off together, so I guess you're really going out with Fuka now. I guess so. So how'd it go with you? Oh, it was a disaster. All the girls kept asking me for your contact info. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Since you finally have a girlfriend, don't mess it up by cheating. Yeah, yeah. I don't even have the ability to do that in the first place. <laughs> hey, what are you guys talking about? Tatsuki got a girlfriend! What? I'm shook. You always turn me down when I ask you out. 
Yeah, sorry about that. It's just that I've liked this girl ever since high school. I see. Hmm. Huh. That's too bad. But I guess that means you must like her a lot, huh? Yeah, it seems like she's always felt the same way about me, too. Aw, how sweet is that? And it work. Hmm. So I guess that means you're now dating the both of us? Why did you include yourself? I'm not gonna date you, senpai! Why not? He just wanna turn me into a sumo boyfriend, right? <laughs> Jokes aside, good for you. Yes, to be honest, I was really surprised when I heard that Fuka was your junior. The group date was awkward, wasn't it? Of course it was. But thanks to you, I guess you could say that our bad feelings have disappeared now. Hmm, I really didn't do anything, though. No, really. Thank you so much, Real senpai <laughs> Well then, I'll gladly accept your gratitude. Oh, yeah, apparently there's a new part-timer starting today. I see. Is it a guy or a girl? I heard from the manager that it's a girl. She goes to my university. Wait, it couldn't be. This is my first day. My name is Fugo Yoshioka. Nice to meet you. Just as I thought. <laughs> it's Fuka chan yay! Ryo senpai Tatsuki, let's work hard together. Just as expected, it was Fuka. Why did you pick her to work part-time? You don't have to worry, I'm not gonna cheat or anything. It's not that, I just wanna be with you. Under the circumstances, for some reason those words made me nervous. Am I a bother by being here? Not at all, I'm happy about it, but uh... Okay, then I'll stay. Yeah, okay. And that's how Fuku and I started working together. There are still some heavy feelings and some jealousy lingering, but she's so cute, so I don't mind being together all the time. We get together notice me well at work, and it's so much easier to work now with her here. Actually, she might even be better at her job than even I am. Though I have more experience. A talented and cute girl like her is such a waste going out with a guy like me. By the way, this is a bonus story. We went to the National Sumo Arena for our one-month anniversary. Ryo Senpai gave us these tickets to celebrate our anniversary, but... I can't believe it's a sumo wrestling match! She's really something, isn't she? As long as we're here, let's make the best of it. Yeah, thanks for real, Senpai. I've been curious about sumo lately. Anyways, what's important is not where you are. It's who you're with. By the way, our first ever sumo match was super impressive and fun. Reminiscing in spring is the best. <laughs> <laughs>